Hello community I hope you are doing good in this discussion we will see what is your election and how to use that and in case you missed previous discussion about how to implement a group in a view level windows action level menu level as well as in the field level with real task cases please check link is given in the description and if you want to learn more about odoo with different topic wise you can visit the playlist under the playlist you can see here odoo development and here different topics available with real task cases apart from this you can see here python related tips and editor related tips also available and if and if you need any support related to odoo you can visit the about page and under you send your query to this email address source code also available in the github and we have some different social media pages you can also follow to get the latest notification and don't forget to subscribe this youtube channel and let's back to our main topic like what is action url right so let's say i'm jumping to the contacts right and it's changing the contact menu let's say i'm going to the student profile it will redirect to the student profile same likewise the student profile also like this right and here the respective uh, urls also we can redirect but let's say if you want to redirect to the specific page right specific page means like out of the odoo or internal odoo pages i mean in the website level or internal url like this that is also possible using url action and there are many types of actions available such as a windows action url action server action report actions client actions and the automated actions i mean the cron job right so like already explained windows action right and this is the second discussion about the url action right and rest we will cover in upcoming session so let's focus about the url action so let's say i want to jump to the google.com or any other website right using the odoo here let's say how we can achieve that redirection action right so let's say i'm going to odoo training custom add-ons the student profile models in the model.py file and here let's say where it is our favorite method oh maybe it's not available here not here also yeah let's try in the in this button click event right and here you can see this is a warning message already covered and if you don't if you don't know you can just visit that playlist and here let's say the button click event right if i'm going to here and open the student profile right so this is uh not this one not this one maybe not this one not this one oh i speak a wrong method so yeah this one so let's say oh first let me expand all right oh so we had a lot of code here let me comment this part and this part so let's say this custom button method right you can see here custom button click me so once i will click to this button it will redirect to the google web page so how can i do this is very simple so let's say we don't need to do something like this right www sorry not like that https plus www.google.com so we don't need to do something like this where let me restart the service right and i'm trying to click this button so you can see nothing happened here right why because it treat as a simple string as a return statement but here we have to implement uh, action the url action so odo understand okay so we have to move to this specific url only so for that like we have to use something like this as a return in a dictionary we have to provide here two things right so first thing is the type and type should be always like ir action actions dot act underscore url that's it and then after comma and here our new key is the url what the url you want to let's say redirect to the page uh, that web page so let me comment 
uh, add this one like let's say I want to redirect to the Google page right now so let me restart the service only no need to upgrade the module and if I will click to this button now you can see it redirect to this page right here you can see it's the google.com and let's say if you want to redirect to the specific any other pages right the facebook.com or anything else so you can also do something like this like facebook or let's say youtube.com well right now you are in the youtube channel it's automatically add something like this way right and so let's say there are many types so you can open the specific url in a different way like let's say the full screen or let's say the current also uh, the current page then after new page by default you can say it's a new page right so let's say if you want to add in a current page right so you can add here the target right and then after you can add as a new uh, sorry not a new so default is a new and here we can add as a self self means the current page let me restart the service first and trying to click to this button now you can see it will open in the same page right let me go back so like this way you can open uh, as a new tab or in the current tab like this way now let's say what about the pages right like this page let's say i want to open this record so for that let me copy this url right and here i will add that url like this way but yeah make sure like you have to generate this url based on your request so i'm just using here the static url all right and let me restart the service and let's say i'm going to in a in this record and i'm trying to click to this button now you can see it will open this record the ramo student right so like this way you can also add plus let's say you have a website right uh so let me uh, we don't have here the website at the moment it will always redirect to the back end side all right so let me add here one more website let me choose the default one all right so this is our website here and i don't want to change anything here i'm just giving you an overview here right the contact page you can see like this now let's say i want to go to in the website right so here either you can copy this url and paste here let me comment this one for a moment right and now i will try to refresh restart the service and i'm trying to click to this button now you can see it redirect to the specific uh, page right here one more thing is you have to always remember the the main website name right right now i'm using the local in my local system so you can see here i'm adding as a local host and the port number right here in the back end as well as in the front end side but let's say i don't want to use this one also right so yeah simple like you can like this you have to add here the slash and then after the contact us right after the url like your specific page so here as a web uh, here you can say as a website there is only one page the contact us right and let me comment this 
part as a self i don't want to use in the current page so let me go to in the back end side here and i'm trying to click to this button now you can see it will automatically open the Udo website plus the contact us page only right using the slash sign if you forgot the slash sign so let's say if you add like this contact us that's also fine right you can see like this right now let's say i want to open the specific record in the back end side without the header that is also fine like this either this or this both are equal the same one so let's try here uh, let me change the student name or let me go to in another oh sorry so we have to go to here like sitaraman here and if i will click to here right this button you can see it will automatically open that record the batman record the ramo sorry this is not a batman okay all right so you can see the this url automatically opened right so you can do two ways like the full path http colon double slash localhost colon 806 oh sorry 6.9 and the URL, the full URL, this is also fine. The sort URL, this is also fine. And, oh, sorry, not like this. And you can also call any other website like this. Google.com. Now it's up to you, like how to use this URL, right? Whether like full path like this or as a sort path like this right so i hope you understood what is url action and how to implement in a method level right button click event in our next session would be like how to create this i have action act url i mean the url action in the xml side and we are trying to call from the menu level all right so let's say here from here let's say i will click to this discussion it will redirect to the specific page all right so see you in our next session and yes if you have if you still have any doubt related this discussion please comment below and see you in next session